Saudi for me, I, I said it before, is like the Formula One of hospitality. You know, in Formula One, uh, whoever is a fan of Formula One, you would know that whatever you do in cars in Formula One, five years later, you find the same technology in the, in the mass production. Things that are happening in Saudi Arabia today on technology, on sustainability, on infrastructure, or new concepts and ideas, you will find them in five years to be mainstream across so many different places in the world in hospitality. So for me, South, you know, what, what is happening in the kingdom is not just about growth and so many hotels and so many, you know, uh, and, and so many visitors or so many tourists. It's actually about the new things that they've been tested in the market that they will change the future of hospitality in the next five to ten years. For us, the, there's a lot of talk about luxury in Saudi. It's all about luxury. I think in order to get the 150 million tourists that the, the kingdom is actually looking for, you have to start looking at, at, at you know, economy and budget and mid-scale. Because, you know, not 150 million tourists are going to stay in the, in the ultra-luxury hotels, right? You need, you need to look down in the mid-scale and the economy level. I have seen... I have seen how passionate the young people are for hospitality. Unfortunately, we don't see that in Europe. Here, people, young people, the young generation, is still very passionate to work in our industry. And I get so much energy every time I come here and I see this, which is, which is phenomenal. So I'm very bullish about the future. I'm very excited about the future. And I think they do it right.